So this is the classic fraud story of finance that's been going on for hundreds of years. And uh, if anybody doesn't know about FTX, you know, I, I don't think we really need to rehash the story here because if you don't know about it, you're probably not interested in it. <laughs> but uh, the bottom line is that, you know, millions of people who thought their crypto was safe were, were uh, absolutely deluded mm. and um, deceived, you know, and the most encouraging thing to me is that most people seem to be actually taking personal responsibility for like, wow, I was really foolish. I made a terrible mistake and uh, I'm I'm probably going to really have to pay the price for that. Hopefully I won't do mm. the same thing next time, you know, but to me, what's so like, I feel ashamed, you know, I feel ashamed to be a part of, of a world that can produce this kind of um, criminal stupidity mm. and deceit. It's so you know, that, that this young man, Sam Bankman Freed could be held up as a hero in our culture when it was so obvious that he was anything but 